this turned out to be a really tricky question because it's so specific and, and different types of vaccines uh, work in different ways. Uh, to zero in on an answer though, it makes sense to start with something general. Um, what vaccines do, which is to provoke an immune response. Vaccines basically kickstart that process by faking an infection, but it takes time for the body to get up to speed and start making the right defensive cells to fight off the intruder. Trials with vaccines approved in the US and the EU, for example, have shown that the first jab does provide some protection against developing symptoms of COVID-19 if you're exposed, but it takes more than 10 days to get there, and, and it's only around 50% effective, uh, much less than when boosted by the second shot, given the specified few weeks after the first one. So here's the scenario you describe. You got the first shot of your vaccination, and then you were exposed to COVID-19, say a day or two later, and ended up with symptomatic disease because your immune system hadn't ramped up the response yet. The Centers for Disease Control in the US says that if that's the case, it's important to defer your second shot until you've recovered. So I assume that means even if that takes longer than the window of time recommended between the first shot and the booster. The few other sources I could find on this specific question recommended definitely getting the booster shot once you've recovered anyway, as the expectation is um, it'll do no harm and will likely actually strengthen your immune response to the coronavirus if you encounter it again in the future. 